he normally just loses to like the PR player. So. All right, well here we go. Game one, Smashville, and K9 has been opting Cloud every single time he plays rival. Yeah, uh, K9's picked up Cloud uh, specifically to fight Fallen. For for Fallen? Yeah. I mean, he's a smart man. Yeah, Cloud still beats Rosa. <laughs> like, uh, he's I mean, very he's smart. Been, he's just really struggling versus Fallen lately. So. Everyone has. Yeah, well, dude's on a 10 win streak. It's actually uh, like 12 or something. 12? Yeah. Last time I saw it was 10. Now yeah. it's 12. Yeah. He's the next zero. Yeah. And so, I mean. I want to see the real result when he goes to a major. He has to win that. Yeah. I wonder if uh, Fall, if you're in chat, are you dodging majors uh, top, top so, eight, though, so you keep that win streak forever? Top eight Genesis? Or is he just going to okay. win? He, exactly. He's getting top eight. No, the, as soon as he got top eight at Genesis, he's like, I'm just going to win everything from now on. And he did. In SoCal, at least. But, uh. Fall, you in here, man? This is hard. It, this is one of the OC's hardest matchups. Fall, you got to. Oh, that's. It is. It's honestly what it is. Just like the uh, the way the the hitboxes for both characters work, it's just not nice yeah. for <laughs> for Zero Suit. It's just not gonna work out. I feel like if Zero Suit ever jumps first uh, versus the Cloud, she's she's gonna lose in the air. Like the back air, and air, up air. Like they just beat out a lot of her aerials. But at the same time, uh, that's normally how she approaches. This looks so yeah, difficult, dude. Yeah, it, it's hard. It's basically what happens is like you have to just find that one opening where the cloud jumps in a bad spot and then you just punish them super hard. I agree. And I feel like it gets to the point of where because you know it's such a bad matchup, you're playing a little bit too hesitant. So the openings that are actually within your grasp, you're hesitant to go for. Like when you see uh, canines or clouds in general, when they have limit and they have a jump, they usually just snap ledge without using limit. They usually just jump onto the stage. And like those are the situations where you just go for a fair. Those are the situations you just go for a back air because they don't want to burst limit and wait for it again in most oh. cases. Dang. He's been doing this every time. He goes zeroes through the first game and then he's like, Sheik time. Yeah, I've I mean, always been picking up uh, Sheik just to like deal with matchups like this. That was really, really hard for uh, zero to so I'm not too surprised, but I already know uh, Kana is just really experienced versus Sheik. I mean, the so man's made them for how many years? It's Four almost, game, three and a half now. <laughs> yeah, so it's it's a better matchup, but Canine's familiar with the character too. So we'll yeah, see. I agree. We, we, we have to see how good a uh, rivalry that edge guarding cloud. It's just hard. But, I mean, Canine's doing a great job of just holding it down at the same time. Like he doesn't give rival many options to get in, like really at all. Yeah. That's why when Rival does get like a good fair, like, like anything to just start like, uh, the string to put Cloud on stage, you have to capitalize. So far, we haven't really seen it. But I feel like you can sometimes see a mental a mental block from a, a player when he constantly just runs onto the character, no matter if it's a grab or a fair or some type of approach. You can just kind of see like this magnet like ask. Oh, he uh, dropped That sucks. Oh, uh, come on. But you can see like like this magnet like. Force like just drifting towards the opponent, at, like at all at all times, like the entire time. Yeah, no Comes back in. On the grab Comes back in all times, and yeah. I feel like it's like a mental block where you just like should just take a deep breath and figure out what you can do from here because it's possible. But I think he's gonna take notes when he comes back from this. That was a really good catch. Good stuff to K9. That was real quick. I hope uh, when he watches the back, I hope he takes the advice because it, it'll help. I honestly think he should just. I, I know it's a, it's a losing matchup for Zero Suit, but yeah. you should really look at how Nairo approaches that matchup. Yeah, I agree. I agree with that. Take, take Nairo's, a, Nairo's a god when it comes to that kind of. I mean, Nairo's a god in general, but like he really shows off how Zero, Zero Suit deals with the matchup in general. All right, I gotta go play. Here we go. Peace out. Right, good luck again. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully Rival can find some answers in that matchup because uh, I know he's just really solid zero suit but he just has some matchup barriers like a lot of like mid-level uh, zero suits do like versus maybe like Cloud, JD, Bayo but uh real quick